Hello everyone. In today's session, we are going to start Bootstrap. So get ready to become a web developer. So basically three things all web developer must learn, right? First is HTML, second is a CSS and third is a JS. All three have different aspects to web developing. First HTML, when you define your content, CSS where you specify the layouts and the stylings of the website and JS to define the behavior or how that website will be interacted with the user we can specify using JS. So these three things must be learned by all the developers. So uh, we already have covered these three things in our previous sessions. So no need to worry for that. Now what is Bootstrap? Bootstrap is a free front-end framework made of HTML, CSS and JavaScript for developing a responsive website. So the obvious question for us is what is responsive website and why we need Bootstrap? Obvious question is that because using HTML, CSS, JavaScript we can develop website then why we need a Bootstrap? Right? So what is responsive website we need to understand first. A responsive website actually automatically adjust themselves to look good on all the devices like if you have a big screen a computer or a tablet or a mobile phone your website should be adjusted according to the width of your screen so let's see an example how it will how uh, what is a responsive and what is non responsive websites for example this is our darshan college website so it is uh, looking good in my laptop but what happens if I open my website with the mobile right that is the difference here is a responsive website and we have one uh, example for the non-responsive website there is a, a website which is non-responsive uh, non it uh, looks good in uh, my computer for sure but but if I open right right click on here and inspect it and I click here it is a uh, desktop based and if I click here it will be open in a responsive or you can select a mobile how it will be looked in a pixel 2 phone or galaxy s5 as you can see if you open that particular website in a responsive way and if you change the screen size it will be displayed something like this you can see the sidebar is gone you cannot no longer see the sidebar you need to scroll uh, horizontally right the biggest problem when you open a mob, uh, website in a mobile this is horizontal scrolling this should not happen in any website vertical scrolling is okay horizontal scrolling should not be there right so this is the problem with this particular website if you zoom this website you can see there is a horizontal scroll bar to see the sidebar you need to scroll horizontally and see the sidebar this is not the easiest way or not it doesn't look good right so what happens with Darshan website let's see if I open uh, if I zoom this particular site you can see the change the content is still intact still you can see the menu right when menu won't be able to fit on this particular screen size it will collapse and the menu will be displayed something like this so there is no horizontal scrolling here also you can see the change there is uh, there are four in a row there are four divisions in a row in this particular screen size when I zoom more there will be only two per row here also two and here also two so it will be divided in that particular way so that there won't be a horizontal scrolling if I still zoom more then only one division per row so it would be very easy or convenient and you don't have a horizontal scroll bar at all right this is what responsive website it will be displayed perfectly on all the screen size so to create such things we need a bootstrap right why to use bootstrap you can do same thing responsive thing with the help of CSS right there, there are media queries in CSS uh, using media queries you can create responsive websites uh, we are definitely going to cover media queries in uh, if in the uh, another session right not in this particular playlist we are going to do in a separate playlist how we can create a media queries 
But using CSS also we can do, then why we are using Bootstrap? That is the question. The first uh, answer would be very easy. It is very easy to use, right? It is super easy to use instead of media query, you need to write for all type of screens if you are writing with the help of media queries, but it is super easy. Anyone with the little knowledge of HTML, CSS and JavaScript can start developing, uh, designing a website using Bootstrap because it's super easy to handle, right? It's responsive features. It will provide a responsiveness. It is mobile. It has a mobile first approach. What it means is nowadays, uh, 80, 90 percentage of the user opens your website with the help of mobile only. So mobile first approach is something that your website will be tested or uh, checked on a mobile first. Your website should be look uh, should look good on a mobile better than even laptop or a computer, right? Because 80, 90 percentage of your users will be from the mobile. So uh, Bootstrap has this feature. It is mobile first approach. Browser compa uh, compatibility, as you know, CSS is having many problems with the compatibility, but Bootstrap uh, resolves those problems and provides us a compatible with all modern browsers. And most important, it's free, right? Bootstrap is free to use. You can use uh, like uh, th there are libraries or you can use their uh, CDNs. It's totally free. So in the next session, we are going to uh, getting started with the bootstrap. Thank you.